about it Monday. Right. And that week I saw an article about a little boy in Utah, 12-year-old little boy, who was bullied to death and did the same exact thing that she did. And I showed her that story. Mm. Like, Rio, this is my worst fear. Do not ever think that this is the answer because I will go to war for you, child. And not just me, but my husband, your dad, your stepmom. Yeah. Your sister's dad, like, all of, you have an army of people. And right. she says, I know, Mom, I know. I think we've all agreed at this point. She knew that she was loved, and she martyred herself. Yeah. Knowing that we will do something. We have to do something. Right. We can't s- sit back and just watch this. Tell us what the morning of the 14th was like for you. If that's okay. Oh, it's awful. Um, I got up like normal. I have a seven-year-old, Avery. The girls were, at the time, sharing a bedroom. I went into Rio's room like I always do. I thought it was weird that the lamp was still on. And the way the room was set up, I did not see her. Avery, you know, girls, time to get up like I always do. And Avery... Thank God, one eye barely open, stumble out into the living room and I'm like, Rio, because that's normally what I would do. And I'd get like a, right. you know, like a grumble. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. And I'd be like, okay, she's awake. And I didn't hear anything. So I yelled again. I didn't 